state these two persons present come now to be joined. If any man can show just cause why they may not be lawfully joined together, let him now speak and thus hereafter forever hold his peace. I require and charge you both that you will answer at the dreadful day of judgment when the secrets of all hearts shall be disclosed, that if either of you know any impediment why you may not be lawfully joined together in matrimony, Be well assured that if any persons are joined together otherwise than God's word doth allow, their marriage is not lawful. Now, Travis, will thou have this woman to be thy wedded wife to live together after God's ordinance and in a holy estate of matrimony? Will thou love her, comfort her, honor her, and keep her in sickness and in health? Taking all others, keep thee only unto her, so long as you both shall live. Mara, take your mother right hand. Repeat 
after me. I, Mara. I, Mara. Take thee, Travis. Take thee, Travis. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love, cherish, till death do us part. To love, cherish, till death do us part. According to God's holy ordinance. What token do you have as evidence that will keep your marriage house? The ring. You have for this purpose selected a ring. This ring is a symbol of your love. Love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or conceited or proud or provoked. Love does not keep a record of wrongs. Love is not happy with evil but is pleased with the truth. Love, or, love never gives up. Its faith, hope, and patience never fail. The ring is the name of the circle until broken by some outside force. It is a symbol of unbroken union that should continue until broken by death. Travis, take this ring and place it on the finger of your bride and say after me. I, Travis, I, Travis, with this ring, do, with this ring, do wed thee, with this Mar. ring, do wed thee, Mar. And with my worldly goods, I thee endow. And with my worldly goods, I do thee endow. Thee endow. And by this act declare. And by this act declare. In the presence of these witnesses. In the presence of these witnesses. That I take thee to be my beloved wife. And I take thee to be my beloved wife. And that I will be faithfully. I will be unto thee faithful. And I'll be unto thee faithful. Uh, a faithful husband. A faithful husband. <laughs> Mara, what token do you give us evidence that you'll keep your marriage vows? You two have selected a ring with its symbolism of enduring ties and unbroken union. And Mara, would you take this ring and place it upon the finger of Travis and say after me, I, Mara, I, Mara, with this ring do wed thee, with this ring do wed thee, Travis. And with my worldly goods, I be in trust, and by this act declare, in the presence of these witnesses, that I take thee to be my beloved husband, and I will be unto thee a faithful wife. Now, you guys like to step up here and uh, light the you can. No wind right now, you might be able to do this. <laughs> light and kill me, friend. For insomuch as Travis and Mara have consented together in holy wedlock, and have witnessed saying for God and his company, and thereto have given and pledged their troth, each to the other, and have declared the same by giving and receiving a ring, and lighting a unity candle, I pronounce that they are man and wife, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Yeah.
Washington.